<laughs> oh man. Two more days, Danny. Two more days. And we'll be finished Squad Builder Week. Two more days! If you can't tell by that intro, I am getting extremely tired of these bloody videos. I love doing them, but doing seven days in a row is a toll on my body, people. They fuck up my sleeping pattern, but you know, I love doing them for you guys. As I said, to all them people that are saying, yo, this is probably too much, there's only two more days, it's this day and tomorrow, and then we're done Squad Brother Week, and then it'll just go back to normal. I'll bring back packs, please, and all that kind of good stuff. So, if you are new around here, and this is your first time seeing my beautiful face, uh, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Um, I don't really care about likes today. Let's just say 100 likes. If you get over that, that'll be insane. And if you are not new around here, hit that subscribe button. Why the hell not? So, if you can't tell by the video already, this is a 250,000 coin Squad Builder. Now, this team has a man of the match that I fucking... Oh my god, he is so good in this game. You've probably seen him on the thumbnail. He is fantastic. Let's get into it. In goal, we have Samir Handanovic, his upgraded card. Now, this card is freaking insane. As you can see, um, like 87. Like, he's just got some incredible stats. He's got a triple stat as well, which is fantastic. He's just an incredible goalkeeper. In defense, then we have one upgrade. No, sorry, we actually have two upgraded players. We have upgraded Chris Smalling and upgraded Miranda. Now, Miranda was always going to be in here. When you see Handanovic in the team, you know what he's going to link to. And that is upgraded Miranda. He is a phenomenal card. 88 defending for like 3.8k is absolutely outstanding. And then you've got this upgraded Chris Smalling card. Now, I used his original card, his 79 rated card, and I wasn't that impressed. This card is fucking insane. Let's put it that way. At fullbacks then, on the left-hand side, you can go for any English left-back. Um, and I didn't use Luke Shaw because I used him in a recent squad builder. And on the right side, we have a Brazilian right back who is Danilo. And on left back, we have Danny Rose. I don't think Danny Rose gets enough attention in this game. His stats are incredible. For, and for less than a thousand coins, you know, you cannot go wrong. Danilo's card is just so well rounded. It's a perfect right back card. In the centre mid positions, then we have a player that this season in real life has been absolutely woeful. And then we have a Brazilian CDM at the right centre mid position. That is Luis Gustavo on the right. And Bastian Schweinsteiger on the left. Now, Schweinsteiger's card in this game is absolutely insane. I love this guy's card. Don't even look at the pace, boys. This guy's card is absolutely sick. And then we got Luis Gustavo, who is one of my favourite CDMs in the game. Not my favourite, but I like the fact that he can score goals and set shit up. At Cam, then, we have probably my uh, favourite man of the match I've ever used on this game so far. And I've used quite a few of them, like man of the match, Ibra, all on like drafts and stuff like that. But... Julian Draxler's man of the match is absolutely fantastic. The first goal in the set eclipse at the end is an absolute belter. Look at them, like five games, five goals, two assists. Absolutely fantastic cam. And he's just so worth it. Four, four star skills, five star weak foot, man. He's just too good. On the wings, we have a player that I said you're going to have to look out for because I'm going to use him in a few other squad builders. And he's back again. He's absolutely insane. And on the left hand side, we have probably one of my favorite players ever to play FIFA and actually to play football, full stop. Um, it's Marco Royce on the left and upgraded Douglas Costa. Oh my god, these guys make the ideal partnership together. Royce is a fantastic left winger and also Douglas Costa is just an absolute beast. Thanks dad, I like how you start the bike as soon as I start recording. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear that outside. That's why dad is Honda Goldwing and it's so fucking noisy. At striker then, we he's probably my favourite striker in the game and I know I've said that with a few people but this guy's card is just fantastic it is upgraded Aubameyang right up the middle boys this guy is a beast five games five goals one assist and the reason he didn't get more was because Julian Draxler was so proficient at cam this partnership right here upgraded Aubameyang and Julian Draxler's in man and match card it blows my mind how incredibly well it plays together. Anyways, guys, this is the full team. 4 3 3 bracket 4 formation. I really like this formation and I really like this team. And uh, as soon as I want to finish the video, my dad then stops the bike. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go on to the clips we got with this team, guys. And watch out for the first clip. Julian Draxler's goal was perfecto. So, guys, as we get on to clips with this team, um, this is Pendulum in the background, if you didn't know. I love Pendulum. Um, what a goal that was by Julian Draxler, I might say. That was the goal I was talking about. Um, absolutely fantastic take, fantastic shot, back of the net. This team plays absolutely fantastically. Now, I've never played with a team that focuses down the middle. And when it does focus down the middle, it's just incredible. Like, Julian Draxler is one of the best cams I have used in this game. Five star weak foot, four star skills. He just feels so nice on the ball, man, honestly. But when it does focus down the middle, 
you've still got incredible wingers at Royce and uh, upgraded Douglas Costa. You know, they're so sick in this game, man. They really are. Like, that was a sick goal by Royce, man. Anyways, Douglas Costa, I've used him before. I absolutely love the guy. You've probably used him before as well. And his upgraded card is fantastic. This is why I love Draxler, right? Watch this pass. First time... Like, what a pass, man. He is such a sick player in this game. I beg you go and try him, man. Literally, he's 160k or something incredible like that. Just go and get him. Try him out. If he doesn't do wonders for you, I'll jump off a bridge. No, I won't do that. What am I talking about? Anyways, the rest of this team. This is the this is the game I have to make sure to tell you. I had to go downstairs to help my parents because, like, they were under a bit of pressure and I had to stand there and do something. I think I had to stir beans or something like that. So they didn't stick to the bottom of the pot. And I went 3-0 down. I paused the game and everything. And I thought he would have scored more goals, to be honest. But it just looks shit on the um, like the clips. But, you know, that's the reason why. I just thought I'd say that. The rest of the team, then. We've got Schweinsteiger and Luis Gustavo in centre mids. I like that they're very defensive. But Schweinsteiger has a banging right foot on him. Luis Gustavo is just an incredible fucking footballer. And he does the job defensively and attacking wise, which is exactly what I want in the CDM. Julian Draxler, as I just said, he just he just makes such great runs. Aubameyang makes such great runs too. He's just a phenomenal player. If he had four star skills, oh my god, he'd be the best player in the game, hands down. Like literally, no joke. Uh, Royce and Douglas Costa, just insane players. You guys have used them before, and there's a reason why they get used a lot because they're absolutely incredible. You got the fullbacks then, and Danny Rose and also Danilo. Just the insane fullbacks, man. They literally, yeah, Danny Rose does not get used enough. And as I said, you, you don't have to use Danny Rose if you don't want to. You could use Leighton Baines. You could use Luke Shaw. You could use Kieran Gibbs. I don't know why you'd want to use Kieran Gibbs, but you could if you wanted to. Uh, you could use any Brazilian right back as well, so you don't have to use Danilo. You could use Maicon. You could use Bruno Perez. You could use whoever the hell you wanted. Center backs then. In uh, upgraded Miranda and upgraded is Chris Smalling. Really solid center backs, and that's literally all you can say about them. They're just extremely competent and they're brilliant center backs this is why i like schweinsteiger by the way and then handanovic in goal is just a fantastic like goalkeeper there's nothing else to say about him anyways guys if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos there'll be one more tomorrow and then that's it for squad builder week we're gonna go back to normal then i'll see you next time have a wonderful day leave a like subscribe and i'll talk to you again bye